relaxing. Ladies and gentlemen, fellow alcoholics, welcome to this advent calendar. And look, I could actually go see an advent calendar. Isn't this how let plays are? You, you're seeing my footage like it's first person. Anyways, but yeah, no, I'm doing this again. And there's an actual advent calendar in this game. There it is. So yeah, so you actually get to click stuff by the way. Function mute. There you go. Ah, so I'm just sitting here again. This is one of the perfect games to just kind of sit around and do nothing. Oh, sorry, my uh, is in the way there. That's why the mouse controls. But yeah, as you see up there, I'm starting to do that. So for those who don't know, I've been streaming this on Twitch. And I'm going to make a big area up there and kind of move everything up there. So this is the perfect mindless kind of repetitive thing to do while sitting in a hotel room doing nothing all day. So today we actually worked. My scrubs are there. I'm tired. And actually we were done by three, uh, two o'clock today. So it's, I mean, I've been here for a couple hours. Ate a healthy uh, thing of whatever this was, pizza melt. So yum as well as a hot pocket, which was actually burnt. So it was more of a burnt pocket, but it's less of a jing uh, catchy jingle that way. Anyways, yep, I'm debating whether or not to get Cyberpunk and because I could play it on this PC probably, this laptop, but I kind of want to play it live for the first time on Steam, but also my computer can't handle it. So again, debates, debates. Also, I was checking up on the cats Makes me a bit nervous. Their food thing, it doesn't seem to be dispensing food like it should be. Like it's supposed to be a gravity thing. It looks empty, but then again, their cats, they'll figure it out. Every time I come back, that thing's pushed against a wall. So when it's rounds of food, I think they go underneath it, kind of just grab the food. Eventually, pretty sure they'll just knock the thing over. But I mean, they're cats, that's what I do. And literally the first night I was here, I pop on my security thing, listen, and sure as shit, what do I hear? Chirp, 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 beep, chirp, 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 chirp. The, still playing with that damn parakeet. Hopefully, if things work as they normally should, that things go run out of batteries or be broken by the time I get home. So I won't have to hear it ever again. So I just find it hilarious. I pop on my camera. The first thing I hear is that thing. Ah, uh, anyways, but yeah, so it's been a kind of boring day. I sat, uh, I was working in a cath lab all day filming, and now I'm sitting here. Uh, gonna play this, probably order some Uber Eats or get something from the hotel uh, restaurant downstairs. Or, I don't know, maybe there's some chicken noodle soup behind me, but enough of that. Let's go get the drinks. Shark glass and drink, drink, drink. All right, which one's which? I think they've gotten mixed up. Oh, no, no. So this one is the latter this is the former so first second all right on to the dice now again there are now two possible failures out of 12 which makes it a one in six chance of getting a wrong number three un dos tres am i counting it doesn't matter which way i count it's the middle either way so that looks interesting again well at least i've had something to eat because this is a hundred proof this is gonna be fun. This would be the perfect Christmas season. Oops, why am I looking up there? That's the best part about this game is you let it run and it actually helps in your favor. What I mean is it's producing stuff automatically this whole time. Where's my lid? Oh, there it is. So I'm letting it run while I have some fun. So anyways, but yeah, so while I'm building all this stuff is producing, so very nice. Again, I'm so used to you actually seeing the screen, not from first person. But anyways, on to the shot. It is a hundred proof Yukon Jack fire. Only the strong survive. So again, that's a hundred proof, 50% alcohol by volume. So, so this is again, fireball on steroids. So fireball itself is 35 catch fire, which I normally drink is 30%. This is 50. So again, 50% of this is pure alcohol. Is that right? Or can it be? No, it has to be pure alcohol again for that to be 50%. So anyways, but yeah, you can see, well, I, I don't know how much you can actually, but yeah, you can actually like graphical things. This computer while having a decent video card still is a little bit, not the great. You can kind of see the pixelization on everything. So yeah, again, nice computer 
can do VR. Still probably a better video card than my PC, but that's because again, my PC is five years old. I need to call them. I need to see, hey, I ordered. Did you associate the two orders? Is that why I haven't got a refund? What's happening? So my ever never ending journey. Ooh, that was it. That poured, uh, by the way, my finish that thought, my never ending journey to get my computer or the refund of the computer. But that poured a bit thicker than it looked. You're not sugary, but I wonder, oh no, it's not that cold, but yeah, poured a bit thick, it looked. Interesting smell. Not the world's strongest smell. What I mean by that, it is a heavy cinnamon smell, but again, 100 proof, you expect, boom, the smell of alcohol. All I smell is cinnamon. Well, then again, I'm so used to cinnamon and whiskey. I wonder now if the line of cinnamon and cinnamon whiskey have become blurred into, uh, blended into one. So, oh, well, but yeah. So here is to great time sink games. They come in handy when you're stuck inside a small hotel room for hours at a time. So here's to, uh, yeah, for saving me time, effort, and money while stuck in a hotel room. <sighs> Smooth. <coughs> Smooth. That's all I gotta say. Don't let my voice change. Man, God, it sounds like a smoke cigarette. Oh my God, that burns. Whew. Not burn, rush, heat. Okay. It goes in. Oh. That's amazing. Okay. <laughs> goes in. Cinnamon. Hot. Cinnamon. Singles in your area looking to mingle. No. It just. Oof. Actually, yes, like ads, they're just everywhere. It just, you open the page, they're just popping up everywhere. You can't avoid them. The heat in your mouth, just from the cinnamon. Then that alcohol warmth. Again, what happened with me is it went in, it's in my mouth. The back of my throat is where the explosion happened. So right there, there's just this poof of alcohol warmth and it spreads like wildfire throughout my mouth. As it goes down though, again, it poured thick it tasted thick. It had this thickness to it. So it goes down kind of this syrupy, what you would imagine syrupy cinnamon, 100% cinnamon would taste like. A 9% alcohol, 100% cinnamon syrup, syrup would taste like. So it goes down this kind of slow, almost molasses it felt like. Anyways, it goes down slow down your throat and just leaving in its trail like lava, warm, warm, warm cinnamon, not alcohol, warm cinnamon taste. And again, it's mixed with the alcohol so well that again, it's, oh, I can't describe. It's not ever clear, of course. So it's not just, oh my God, alcohol, numbness, burning. It's this cinnamon goodness. Oh my God, my mouth can't handle the warm, the sugariness and Again, it's a weird, good, bad mixture. Uh, that's just amazing. So, okay, if to describe the cinnamon though, I can't describe it more than syrup, syrup cinnamon. And I mean sugary. So like if you mix a sugar mixture with a sugar, um, what I'm trying to think, not, again, not maple syrup, but just melted sugar syrup. Mm. Ooh. And again, it goes down slow and warm, but it's all cinnamon, no alcohol. So it does go down smooth in that sense, but the alcohol mixed with that cinnamon warmth just makes it go down rough in that essence. Again, so the roughness is the cinnamon hot, not the alcohol. That's what I'm trying to get because this was an experience, a good one. And again, I'm not opposed. I might do this again. Mix that with Pepsi. Again, I always default to Pepsi. It's a high sugar, and also I grew up in a Pepsi household. So, 
you know, I learned it from watching you, Dad. Uh, I'm back, sorry, I had a thought there. Anyway, there was this time when there was a cinnamon Pepsi. You know, it was a thing, it was kind of your own fireball. That would go perfect with it, because again, that kind of sugary, thick, good taste that cinnamon had would go perfectly with that, and the alcohol would go away mixed in with the sugary Pepsi. Now, it is still 100 proof, there'd still be some alcohol, but by that point it'd be so deleted, uh, diluted, rather, it'd be just like regular fireball or regular whiskey, so. But that chirpy, uh, chirpy, oh no, it's, that tweeting's on my mind now, no. The syrupy cinnamon goodness would stay present in the Pepsi, so. Dear Lord, that was, again, an experience. Like, now looking back on it, kind of like uh, most things, like, oh, it wasn't that bad. Then again, I remember my voice sounded like a smoker there for a second, but yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, would do it again. That wasn't bad. Because mm. it's weird that it was thick. That was weird, so. Anyways, all that aside, uh, whew. so I, anyways, I need to, again, I'll keep an eye on the cats, as it were, because again, if the food doesn't get distribute, distributed, or it doesn't fall down through the gravity thing, I'll ask one of my uh, friends or neighbors to come by and just shake the thing to, you know, get the food flowing, as it were. But they're cats. They'll figure it out. They're strays. They were eating long before I got there, so... One of the ways this will work. Otherwise, uh, yeah, let me know how you guys are doing. It's, what, about the, it's not quite the middle of December, but it is kind of the middle point of, say, the holiday shopping center. I mean, we're almost at the 12 days, as it were. Oops. Uh, so, mm, all that aside... Ooh, excuse me, again, momentary pauses, because again, it's, that's the thing is, it didn't taste strong, but I know it's strong. So I'm wondering if I'm starting to feel the effects early on of the alcohol. Hmm, because that's a good sign of a good tasting alcohol, when even though it's strong as balls, it actually doesn't taste it. So that cinnamon hides a lot. <laughs> that cinnamon burning is easily covering up for the alcohol burning. So anyways, all that aside, let me know how you're doing, say, kind of the midway point of the holiday season. Uh, even though that's now been extended past Thanksgiving, but we'll forgive that. Just December holiday season, midpoint of it. So whew, all that aside, I'm going to end this video before I start rambling incoherently and have to put weird pauses in anyways. So all that said, thanks again for watching. See you next time.